Some terrifying moments for parents watching as their children were carried away in a bouncy slide, picked up and carried by the wind. ABC's Marcy Gonzalez with the pictures and the safety experts tonight. A major scare caught on camera. Two 10 year olds were in this bouncy slide yesterday in Littleton, Colorado, when a gust of wind up to 30 miles an hour sent it tumbling 300 feet across a field. One of the children thrown to the ground, the other trapped until the slide finally came to a stop. We were just horrified. It is a horror becoming all too familiar. Just three weeks ago, this bounce house in upstate New York was carried 50 feet into the air during a windstorm, seriously injuring two children. The Consumer Product Safety Commission estimates more than 5,000 people were injured on bounce houses just last year. It happens every day. Anthony Amoroso, a certified bounce house distributor, says the key to safety is properly securing the inflatables with sandbags or stakes. And in case of unexpected wind gusts, his operators are always just a step away. The attendant could grab right away the tether. The owner of Airbound, the company operating the slide involved in this weekend's incident, tells ABC News it was properly staked to the ground, adding, quote, we feel terrible for what happened. Safety is our number one concern. Officials say both children were treated for minor injuries. One was hospitalized as a precaution. Marcy Gonzalez, ABC News, New York.